For the first time, a Japanese car company has decided to build cars in Canada. Honda has chosen a site in Alliston, Ontario. The company will spend $100 million in the town and give jobs to 350 people. Alison Smith reports. Alliston, Ontario is a quiet farming community northwest of Toronto. Population 5,000 and growing. This empty field just outside town is the site for the new plant. The townspeople had heard rumors about it and they're delighted with today's news. Oh yeah, it'll be good for businesses like ours and uh, generally it'll be good. It's, it's progress sure. and we like to see progress. Well, it'll give 350 more jobs. That's what they're saying, so why wouldn't that be great? We're just happy to have them here. Honda already makes cars in the United States. Officials announced the company's Canadian plans in Ottawa with Trade Minister Ed Lumley. Lumley described the new plant as a breakthrough. The growth that has taken place by Honda in the United States operations has been nothing short of phenomenal. And we're very hopeful that uh, we will have the same rapid growth uh, here in Canada as Honda has undertaken uh, in the U.S. Lumley says the new plant doesn't mean the government will lift its restrictive trade quotas on Japanese cars. This really is a, a very, very small, but I think important step to, in terms of locating of Japanese facilities here. The United Auto Workers when Union wants to know just how Canadian the cars will be. That is, where will the parts come from? Japanese car plants in the United States aren't unionized. What about in Canada? It will be several years before those questions will be answered. Honda doesn't expect a car to come out of Alliston until 1987. Allison Smith, CBC News, Alliston, Ontario.